Hello everyone, welcome back to another Dolly 3 video or ChatGPT Dolly 3 video. In this one, I'm going to show you how to create images in a consistent style. It's very easy to do. It should take like 60 seconds for me to show you. Here is an example of a French Bulldog I created and I just made really simple prompt, create an image of a French Bulldog reading a book. And then down here, I did the same thing except in English Bulldog and you'll notice the style consistency. Let's go through it step by step. It'll take a few seconds at most. Okay, so the first step you need to do is you want to click on the explore button on the left side and then click on Dolly. You need to make sure that Dolly is selected, at least at this time. It may change in the future. Then when you're in the little prompt here, just type in, I don't know, um, French Bulldog on a trampoline. I don't know. I'm just having some fun here. Hit enter. I'm going to see what this comes up with. It should take a few seconds. I'll come back when it's done. Then I'll show you the next step. All right, so I just did a very simple prompt and in here are the two images. This one's pretty good. Let's take a look at the second one here. I'll just click on this little arrow. Okay, I like this one. So here is the critical step. What you need to do is you got to go please, or you don't have to use please, but I'm Canadian, provide me with the gen IDs for both images. Now, you don't have to type it out exactly like that. You could probably just say, hey, what are the gen IDs? But these are generative IDs that are basically uh, like seeds, except, well, they call them gen IDs because I guess they want to be original. So here they go, the gen ID for the first one, gen ID for the second one. I'm just going to copy that here, this little string here, 2RR30, whatever the heck it says. And then I'm just going to go with this. Uh, uh, let's go English Bulldog jumping on a trampoline. And then... The last final part, the important part here, here we go, in the style of, and then I'm just going to copy and paste in that gen ID. Now I'm just going to let this run. I'll come back when it's done, show you what we got, and that's it. Awesome. So here it is. This is the gen, this is the uh, bulldog in a nice cool style, and you can see the uh, shadow on the trampoline here, and then this is the French bulldog. It's fantastic. Keep in mind, this is for consistent styles, not for consistent characters. That's a little different. And uh, ChatGPT Dolly 3 doesn't quite have that down yet. But there you go. That's all there is to it. Thanks for watching.